There's something that I talk about a lot, really understanding what the word grit means. Teams like us that have a lot of talent, passion and perseverance for a long-term goal, and the long-term goal is to win the World Series. In our world today, there's a lot of gray, but when you're trying to uh, win a championship and do things the right way, it's simple. Are you in or are you out? How has spring changed for you as you enter your sixth year with this organization? Not that much, actually. You still show up and you still have to go to work and try to find ways to get better and you still want to prove your worth every single day. So it doesn't matter what your situation is in this clubhouse. Hopefully you're showing up every day to, to work hard and, and prove to everyone who's on the outside looking in that you deserve to be here. You guys, uh, welcome. Welcome to uh, spring training. I'm not going to talk too much about last year. Um, I think that uh, there was a lot of good things that happened, a lot of guys that grew. Uh, I was looking at some things before uh, I came into camp, and I realized that we used 52 different players last year on the major league roster. And we've got 60 guys in camp. So if you look at the numbers, every single person in this room is gonna to lead to us winning a championship in 19. The most important thing for this ball club, this organization is, is winning in 2019. You have to take the experiences and what you went through the last couple of years and, and learn from it. And that's all we can do. We can't change the past. We gotta focus on 19. So that's my job as manager is to build on what we've done. And we have a lot of good players and a lot of good things going on with the expectation to win the championship this year. I think the thing is for our guys, that's what's made us so great, is that we have this amazing ability to look out and to see where we want to go as an organization, individually, and then now to kind of taper back and really understand how we get there. And so that's the difference maker from good to great. So to understand, look out, we're gonna win the championship in 2019. You guys individually are gonna have great years. And now to eliminate all that noise and to go back and to say, it starts here today, and every throw that I make, every exercise that I do in there, every stretch, whatever you do is with the purpose. So what was the message today? Just uh, remaining steadfast in, in how we go about preparing each day, understanding the ultimate goal, but more importantly, how we get there. There's a culture, there's a professionalism, there's a, a toughness in there. I think for us as a team to eliminate the noise outside and just kind of focus on getting better each day. Who do you got today? Huh? Who are you facing today? Canley. Ooh, nice. Day one. Day one, I like it. Who do you got, CT? Kenley. Who, you said, who you got, Kenley, as well? Uh, uh, me, Ruf. me, CT, and JT. Okay. Who do you got, Munz? Rue. Oh, yeah. Rue's a good first day. There's definitely a sense of camaraderie, energy. When you get the pitchers, catchers, and then now you introduce the position players, it is just so much fun to see those guys meld. And, and it's something that it's just the energy I just can see and I know that we can sustain it. Where's the music at, man? It's coming. I asked that. Thank you. We need some music. Nice, Richie. Do it again. Infield back, infield back. You look what we're doing. This is what we want. I love it. These guys are gonna make us look real good.
Oh, I was gonna say, uh, this spring training. Uh, yes. Can I, can I mix in a little bit more steals, just in the? In I would the, love yeah, that. Yeah, because I, I mean, I know. Hey, I get thrown out. I get thrown out. No, spring I training. would love that. I, I just. Need, I just need to get out there, and I, I mean, hey. Do you? I would love that, you know, man. There might be, like, a couple trial and errors, but I need to get past that. Like, it's just a mental thing now. It's not about but me. But it shouldn't not, be for you. Exactly. It's not about me being able to be fast enough to steal, no. have the jumps. I have it. I can do it. I just need to be out, get out there, get the reps, and get Part, the, comp like, the confidence I, in I it. love hearing you say that, because what you have, you're a baseball player. You're tough, and you're a baseball player. Like, I, but how do you... You have to have the ability to like trust that you can do whatever you want. You, there's nothing on the baseball that you physically can't do. And it's like, I want you to do that. Yes, I want you that. I want that. What's changed for me over the last four years and four springs is I'm very familiar with the personnel now. And, and we've obviously had changes um, over the years, which every team does. And the relationships that I have with the front office, uh, the players, staff is obviously stronger. I think I've grown and, and have plenty of room to get better. I have a lot of good people around me to help me. My job, my goal personally is to get better each day and to always learn. The, the thing about the Dodgers is the flexibility where everybody playing everywhere is yeah. the best thing in the world. It is. Because when it comes to double switches, it makes it so easy. It, make, it makes it so easy. And then like their openness to do it, or even you know certain guys, man, you'll start a game and then you won't, and they keep the mindset is like, I can still win the game for the next three, four innings. And it's like, we have to, that's the, that's what teams can't match up against us. And ultimately, if they, these guys can bind to that, which they are, it puts them in the best position to have success at the end of the game or the beginning of the game. Everybody, there's no bench players. No. That's what's huge. We don't have bench players. Go two for two and feel great about the day. That's, that's right. You know. What we've done to get this organization to a certain point, I think that there's a lot of positivity in that. And I think that, you know, when you're in uniform and you're playing and you're mired in this, you have to build on the positives and use that as momentum. When you're talking about a team that has so much talent in the room and that's really done nothing but win, to keep guys building on what good we've accomplished and understanding and appreciating that there's still some work to be done, our guys are all in. Good stuff, right? Which way? Me. Where else would you rather be? Where else would we rather be? Nowhere. Nowhere. <laughs>